What was the most defining moment of your life, Diane? Again, it can be more than one, personal or professional. Okay, I'm going to go way back. Um, I was a non-traditional student. Um, after I graduated from high school, I decided I would not go to college. I decided that I was would be a farm wife, basically. Okay. I was from a farm background. I still live on a farm, a family farm, but I decided I would go that direction. Mm -hmm. And it was in the mid-70s, and the farming was becoming very difficult, so we, we struggled. And I realized one day that something was going to have to change, so right. I decided to go back to school. Mm -hmm. And I started college at that point. I already had two children, and it was a, a big decision, but I was so determined that we were not going to lose the farm mm -hmm. and that I was going to do what I could to keep that from happening. And I had always enjoyed accounting, Mm -hmm. So I decided to go that direction, and it's been an unbelievable journey. Mm -hmm. But to think that I came from someone who almost didn't go to college mm -hmm. to where I am today, it's, that's, that's yeah, what's remarkable. It is. Mm -hmm. What is the biggest professional triumph of your journey or life? And it could be personal as well. I would say that the, there are two. One, when John and I started our firm sure. originally, and the second one was when we merged uh, with Mount Joy Bressler in 2010. Mm-hmm. To put this, these two firms together, we were almost the same size, mm -hmm. um, as far as revenue, almost identical, and that just wasn't done. You didn't right. merge two firms that were sure. similar size. It was sure. always an acquisition. So we talked about, realized we had the same vision. So overnight, we went from a firm of 110, 15 people mm -hmm. to 230. <laughs> Bam. Yeah. And it, it, was, um, it worked out well. It could have been... A major challenge or a sure, major... Sure, it could have. Yeah. So you weren't like Noah, you didn't end up with two of everything? No. Or did you have that challenge? Or we, no? we talked about sure. the, the Noah approach, but we right. decided to do the best approach. So okay. we literally sat down and worked through everything. That is great. What is the best piece of advice ever given to you, Diane? Again, it could be more than one, personal or professional. Okay, I would say the, the best piece... I'm a perfectionist. I'm, mm -hmm. I, as you can tell, I do strive for excellence. And when you do that, you can... Be beat yourself up a lot. Oh, yeah. So the best advice I received was the more you do, the more your mistakes you're going to make. And right. they weren't huge mistakes, but, you know, you can take them personally. So it's to keep it in balance. If you're doing a lot, if there's a lot going on, don't expect yourself to be perfect. Mm -hmm. And people don't expect you to be perfect. 